Waypoint. Kwang Ha Insane. Why would I say NJ if I know he goes to Waypoint often? Is Tri-State New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut? Yes. Okay. No. It's uh, PA? That's not Tri-State. That's the thing. I thought that. I was wondering whether Pennsylvania was Tri-State or not. That Parts of Pennsylvania are New Jersey. That's what you're saying. And I think every person in Pennsylvania would mob you right now. Tri-State is more than three states, don't at me. <laughs> <laughs> Tri-State is uh, also includes Massachusetts. NE. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All of NE is really just Tri-State. <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, yeah. well, the California is just Tri-State. <laughs> 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 if you think about it, you just don't think about it. Japan's kind of a Tri-State <laughs> region, you know? Japan is a state of me. <laughs> oh, he's not. Listen, if we combine New York, and if we combine Tri-State and Japan, then it's definitely the best region in the world. Yeah. Did you see the did you see the statistic thing? Of Where what? it's like, uh, it was like PR points based off of like the state. You want to know what one? Was it Tri-State? Tri-State. I mean, yeah, Tri-State's <laughs> tri -state freaking nuts. the best. Ooh, gang gang, turnip, meh. All right. Anyway. All right. Okay. So let's actually get to the match here. Yeah. Uh, Bolero. Um, he actually took the first stock with a really good forward smash. And I mean, the thing is, that's gonna be the matchup. Is Bo can Bolero get not only damage but stocks off of the ledge trapping? Yeah. This because is Peach kind of struggles getting off ledge a lot of the time. This is like <laughs> a super ledge trap game. Like super ledge trap bros. Or sisters, I guess. Oh. But like, I feel like. I feel like Zelda could just like invalid invalidate Daisy more than Daisy validates her. I like, mean, he, Daisy has Daisy. Zelda has like some stuff off the ledge, and then like Phantom is just like such a check, where it's like, yeah. oh, oh, you didn't do an action in time, so slash, you're done. Ooh. Like, okay. I will also mention regarding Phantom, the f it really limits the float heights from Peach. Oh, Imagine yeah. Peach can, or Daisy in this case rather, can still maneuver around it, but it is. Oh, that's a stitch! That's a stitch! That is a stitch. Didn't kill though, but look at all I that damage. What? Oh. I mean, stitch is not designed to kill in this game. Yeah. It's designed to do 35%. Yo, you want to know what else deals 35%? Snake of C4 to forward there. Neutral there. That does like. That does 41. That's stupid. Yeah. Wait, only 41? What do you mean only 41? Because down, so uh, C4 does 25. Yeah. And then neutral layer. Oh, we just saw a Saturn. Neutral layer does like 22, right? It's like 41. Hence the like. You always, right. always got to cover yourself as a commentator. <laughs> Ambiguity is key, man. <laughs> so what here we saying? have a match of like two people, sort of. You know, this, this, this can, the winner this could be you know either one of them yeah. at this point in time. Yeah. Let's Bolero, actually, this is kind of hype right now. Bolero, Bolero kind of has a lead. Bolero already had a huge upset getting here, taking out Bobo, and he is on the brink of taking game one. Oh my RNG! Oh my! In that game, he got a stitch, a Saturn, and a Bobo. In that in that order. In that order. And he died at, what was that, 50? That was 50. He died at 60 or 50. <sighs> on the one hand, he could have reacted to it. Probably should have. But on the other hand... He got robbed. <sighs> and he was playing so well. He got robbed. He was playing so well. This this right here, this is what determines good players. What really determines if you get If you get super robbed and you've got that mentality, that's, that's like the... That's like step one of like super good player. You got uh, that ironclad mentality. Mentally untouchable. <laughs> All right. Uh, so how many stitches slash bombs slash do you see? We're going to take bets right now. All right. Side bet? I'm saying, side yeah, bet? we're going to side bet for RNG turnips. <laughs> uh, I'm going to say we're going to have at least another. We're going we're gonna to get a beam sword. <laughs> This, it's he's gonna it's break coded the in the game. game and beam sword is gonna come it out of it. It is coded in the game. Fun fact. What? It is coded in the game. You just have a zero percent chance of getting it. It's it coded in the game. No, no cap. No whatever. It is coded. Oh, jeez. Oh, Blair is so angry, dude. I love that bait though. 
because he put himself at a position where in order for Peach to space perfectly around it, he had to put himself in the exact spot that was the sweet the spot kick. of the... Uh, the lightning kick or the fair that was the That was the phantom. No, he didn't he die to fair? He died to phantom. Oh. He went out there. So this is the thing. Like, Bolero is, oh, sorry, Blank was, like, floating out there. And he goes and goes, like, he charged up the phantom. Went out there and neutral aired at a spacing where, obviously, Blank wanted to forward air him. And for that, he needed to retreat ever so slightly. But that put him in the exact blade swipe of phantom for the kill. That was just wonderful baiting and coverage by Bolero. Even though he lost that game one in kind of a cheesy way, it feels like he's... Doing all right for himself right now. He does not seem shook very much at all. Oh, uh, this is something we haven't really seen that much of yet. Well, is crazy peach combos. Yeah, I mean it's hard. On like a floaty character that has like frame three intangibility or whatever. It might be frame four. Yep. Frame whatever intangibility. <gasps> is that enough? No. Nope. That was a really oh my the last God. hit of it. Last hit of it's actually really big. I mean, I, uh, I now I know. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Give him the golf swing. But the question is, can Valero do much with this lead? Because honestly, for the most part, he's getting these big stocks, and then they kind of just disappear on him. Yeah, this is an even game, despite the fact that it felt like Valero was playing so strong. Yeah, it, he's starting to get like a little bit antsy with the the Nehru's love. Yeah, I mean, he needs to chill. All right, and also let's—I do want to comment on the composure My from God. Blank. You know, he's not letting any of the things that are happening to him phase him at all. He's, st he's sticking to his game plan, and it is working well. I love that limiting his space uh -oh. with the Phantom, and he goes uh -oh. out to meet him. Even more damage. <gasps> he went oh, through true. everything, everything. Not just one thing, everything. Look at how big those shields <gasps> are. Oh, that thing so lasts long. forever. That thing lasts for three years. It's a minus three years. <laughs> minus three years on frame. <laughs> on frame. I'm <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, okay, 109. We're back to neutral. And this is where Bolero just loves to just press that, that down B button. <gasps> oh, he managed to roll behind him. Oh, and the up air to close out the stock. We now have a game three in winner semis. The winner of this goes to winner finals. I don't think Bolero has ever gotten top three before. I don't think so either. And I don't think it's deniable that he is playing really well tonight. Yeah, that that like that showing like so. Yeah, really and this nice. is a best of three set. The winner of this next game wins the set. Yes, this is. What, do we go to FD? Wait, no, 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 no! Don't tell me what's FD. Did we go to FD? No. I missed it. No. Oh, oh, oh. Why? All right. All right, Bolero is like gonna have a field day on FD. Possibly. However, at the same time, <laughs> having FD means no platforms, no shenanigans with that. I feel like this is blank as I can win. Yeah, no, this is like this, this is a stitch. <laughs> is that this a stitch is, or Saturn? That was that was Saturn. I meant to say Saturn. But like this is this is this is a statement. Honestly, this is this is blank saying. You know what? This may be dumb, stupid for you, but I don't care. I'm getting my damage. I want more uh, damage because I'm, I'm gonna a smush you. Yeah, no, uh, that's just a call out. Like this stage pick, this stage pick is just a call out. <gasps> oh, <laughs> oh, that's really unfortunate. And I don't think we've seen the Valero have to make a big comeback like that yet. No, uh, a lot of uh, like a lot of his just like neutral and like just wins in general have been just like just like consistent neutral. Where it's like he may get hit. He may get hit. That was a misinput. Oh, uh, this takes all this damage for it. Okay, he gets out of it with yeah. minimal punish. Okay, uh, look, he's so comfortable. Blank feels like he's in his space now. Games one and two are a memory. Right now it is game three. FD. This pressure on rival. Blank overlap. No, Bolero overlapping. Blank right now. Oh my god. Now, Zelda does have, you know, some really strong moves. Uh, her upbeat could maybe get a really early kill, especially That's with a rage. But other than that, it's it's going to be a uh, real steep climb for Bolero. Little damage here and there. All of it counts. Blank knows that. He's playing so carefully, even when he has this much of a lead. And that puts him at three stocks to one. Blank, despite the fact that game one was sort of, you know, given to him, and game two he lost, honestly, pretty handily. 
He's he's in it. Uh, he's on a track to just meet his bro in uh, winners finals. Ooh, you can just you can just tell like the the what's it called the body language on these two players. Like Blank is just like so focused and like he's really in it. And like Bolero, when he lost his like second stop, just like he just sat back down and like he put his back to the chair, and now he's like. He's also like really, oh, really. Oh, that's good. a big grab. 65%. The reflector coming out, but I feel like like this FD pick, it worked out so well for them. Oh, so well for yeah. Them. No, I think that's undeniable. You know, it might be question. This is one of those things where, like, where it's like it, why it's would not you do just, this? Well, you know, it's not just characters do not alone decide what stage you want to go to. Yeah. A lot of times it's players, a lot of the time it's, you know, what you how they what your strengths actually are against the opponent. And as we see right there, Blank displaying his strength wins the last game in a pretty low percent two stock.